This is the story of DMT, or dimethyltryptamine, a simple compound found throughout nature which has profound effects on human consciousness. DMT, the spirit molecule, you know, it's a conundrum, it's a paradox. DMT is uh, astonishingly widely available in plants and animals all, all around the world, but so far nobody really knows why it's there. Why is DMT in our bodies? Why is it in plants? all sorts of mammals, and what is the role it plays in human? And that was one of the original findings uh, that led me to start looking for a spirit molecule, for a, a, a compound in the brain that uh, elicited mystical experience. Why, why is there a part of the brain that seems to be, for lack of a better word, a, a god detector? I'm actually quite, quite convinced that we're probing the biological basis of moral and ethical behavior. To my mind are, is this kind of two-edged sword of s simultaneously opening up to the numinous world, to the world of messages, the world of spirits, the world of entities. We're desperate to find new information, ideas, and so on that can, can transcend. We have to evolve.